Hey everyone, I'm Agonix here and welcome back to a brand new Halo 5 Forge creation of you here on the channel. So today I'm going to be taking a look at the Halo 3 Flood Carrier, or just the Flood Carrier in general since it's from other Halo games, but I don't know if this is a Halo 3 specific one or not, but yeah. And also I'm also going to be taking a look at the Halo 3 Classic Elite pack. Now obviously they're all dead as you can see, but yeah. We're going to be taking a look at this today as well. So we've got two creations here, and here are the creator's names. First I'll display the name of the Flood Carrier's creator, and then the Classic Elite Pack's creator. So right off the bat, let's take a look at this Flood Carrier. Now if you guys do enjoy, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe for more. And I've noticed too recently, just by looking at my YouTube analytics, that a lot of my watch time comes from people who are not subscribed, and apparently it's like 95.6% of you or something like that. Let's try overturn that. If you're watching this video and you're not subscribed, be sure to subscribe. I want to try see the subscribed raised from 4% to say 10% we'll try. And we'll try overturn the non-subscribed. So yeah, if you do enjoy, be sure to subscribe and let's get right into it. So first up, I just want to say this Flood Carrier looks really, really good. And it looks like it has the same sort of style as the Flood Tank that I took a look at. So maybe they're made by the same creator. And if so, uh, that Flood Tank was actually really, really cool as well. And even if you got a certain bit of distance away from it, it did sort of look like the Flood Tank. And this Flood Carrier has the same sort of effect as well. It'd be cool if this thing could explode too. Obviously it can't, because I even try shooting at it. And I didn't expect it to explode, but I just want to shoot at it. But yeah, it would be real cool if it, if it could explode. That would be something that would be cool to see. So honestly, there's not much else to say about this Flood Carrier. Honestly, I do wish there was more to say, since it is a cool creation. And it would be cool to just, you know, talk about it more, but... Unfortunately, there's nothing more else to say other than that it's a really, really good creation, and uh, yeah, good job on the creator for making it. And I wonder if the person has more Flood-related re creations as well, that would be very interesting to check out. So next up, we have these Dead Elites. Now, as you can see, these are basically the Halo 5 Dead Elites, but they've got some extra added parts onto them, so then they look more classic and Halo 3-ish. So as you can see, their helmets have been changed, there's been extra armor added to their arms, and soon enough I do actually uh, take these elites out of phased, because they're in like a, they're locked in phased at the moment, which if you don't know what that is, that's like the uh, physics mode, I mean, yeah, that's the physics mode they're locked in at the moment, is phased. And uh, I do end up switching them to normal, which ends up like making all the armor just drop off and everything, so then you can see what has been added. But yeah, I mean, overall, these do look like the, like, classic style of Elites. Even though, you know, they're just using the Halo 5 Elites as the base, they do end up adding more stuff onto these Elites to make them more resemble the old style, and the person did definitely do a good job of doing that. Like, if we were to have, say, classic Halo 3 Elites in Halo 5 right now, this is probably what they would look like. Not exactly like this, but somewhat like this. Honestly, it is a really, really good uh, idea, and I do like how the person did multiple of these as well, like a pack of them. So yeah. Now here it is when I do switch out of phased into normal physics mode for this object. And uh, yeah, as you can see, all the armor just drops right off. And uh, you can see what exactly has been added. So there's actually been quite a bit of armor that has been added onto these elites. So good job on the creator for doing this. It would have probably taken a while, you know, precisioning it all right and stuff like that, or finding the objects in the first place to be able to use. So yeah. Anyways, guys, that is the end of this video. If you did enjoy, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe for more. What do you think about these creations? Be sure to tell me down in the comments below. And yeah, I'll see you all next time. Bye-bye.